At Whitcomb in the Moor, it's the day of Devon's most famous fair. This year, a new mare made her debut in an old pot. Uncle Tom Cobbley had a new mount. For 35 years, her predecessor lived up to the words of the old song, but last winter, the old grey mare died. But that didn't stop Uncle Tom. Pillow fights are a star turn at the fair. To round off the day of the fair, Whitcomb's tug-of-war team showed a Newton Abbott side their way home. Cardiff Castle, built on the site of a Roman fort nine centuries ago, with its 450 acres of parkland, becomes the property of Cardiff citizens. On Castle Green, Lord Mayor Ferguson receives the key from the Marquis of Butte. The Butte standard flies next to the flag of Cardiff. For nearly 200 years, the Butte family have owned the castle. Now, Cardiff aldermen and councillors enter the Norman Gate to take over their new showpiece. Mayor presented a casket and scroll to Lord Butte, expressing the city's gratitude for this gift. And at night, in Sophia Gardens Field, the city went gay. Fireworks and rockets marked the end of a memorable day in Cardiff's history.